oh, I wish I didn't get such a short haircut because I could pull some hair out. Do you ever have a client who's, or a prospect that's driving you crazy? Oh, life is too short for people who drive you nuts. Give you an example. Got a guy, we negotiated a, a real estate deal, and you know your Uncle Claude, I'm very specific about time and date and contracts and everything. Get commitments up front. And I've talked about that just recently in another video, okay? Don't go to a meeting unless you, you know, you know specifically they're going to be there. And get commitments. Call them a few minutes before you get in your car, stuff like that. Anyway, I've got this one guy, okay? And I'm, the question I'm asking you is, should I fire him? Do you think I fired him? And we negotiated everything, did the contract, sent him the contract. Now, all of a sudden, all these little problems. Oh, Claude, I don't like to send electronic documents back and forth. Uh, why don't we get together again? Um, I want to edit and make some revisions here and there and everything. And I know you want to move forward, but I need, I need to, I take uh, these things very seriously. The guy wants to move like an effing snail after we negotiated and did everything. This kind of person drives me nuts. You get a commitment up front, you have the little honeymoon period, everybody has their little job to do and transfer of money and things like that, and then boom, all of a sudden they put up roadblocks and problems. So what am I gonna do? I'm gonna fire this dude. Life is too short. Now listen, I don't wanna sound like a big shot. When I was first starting business, I put up with these characters. These, these people who just, oh, they're like, you know what a gadfly is? You know that fly when you're outside and, you, and it keeps following you and it won't go away? There are people like this. There are people also, um, they're pathological liars. They go through life lying all the time. There are people who are sociopaths. They don't care about other people's feelings or anything like that. You're going to get people like this. And if you're, and I understand hunger and I understand business. And when you're hungry, you have to eat a little, you have to eat some shit sometimes, don't you? Sorry about the language, but that's what you got to do when you're hungry. But once the beauty of getting a business up and running and having a certain amount of success, financial success is you could fire these bums. And that's what I'm going to decide to do. Life is short. Some people just want to make you miserable. They can't keep commitments. They start obfuscating, changing the subject. They won't be specific. You've negotiated everything already. You did the contracts. You set up meetings. And all of a sudden, all these problems come up. Your Uncle Claude's advice is fire the fool. Don't. I mean, I understand. Sometimes you just got to put up with it. But you know what? The whole point of all these videos is to get you so successful, to have, have that coin in your pocket so you don't ever have to take garbage from people like that. There's not many people like that. I'm a glasses half full kind of guy. You know that about your Uncle Claude. I, will, I love people. I love doing business, honest, straightforward, direct business, okay? I even, one of the things I teach is, hey, Mr. and Mrs. Prospect, would you please fire me? It's okay to say no to me. I don't want to waste time, resources, energy, or money in a situation that'll never happen. So I'm very upfront with people about that. But every now and then you're going to meet this kind of nudnik, this kind of, <laughs> even my New York is coming out. And they get your blood pressure up and they get you emotional, okay? And you don't think straight when you become too emotional, do we? And all I'm telling you is, is life is sure fire these fools. And get on, and they, you know what? My dad used to say, when you miss a bus, there's another one in 15 minutes. Get rid of the people who suck time, suck the oxygen out of the room, make you unhappy, and get back to work, make those phone calls, and guess what? You'll find another prospect who will be a total delight. You'll make more money, and you'll live happily ever after. <laughs> because nobody, you know what's coming, nobody deserves success more than you. And this is your Uncle Claude here. I do answer my own phone, 970-281-5151. Go to my webpage, ClaudeDiamond.com. If you like these videos, this motivates me when I get these thumbs up. Share them with your friends. Hit the subscribe button and the little bell if you want to get up when I do these videos. I try to do them on a pretty regular basis and you guys you just have have a good life have fun and give good fun take care thanks for joining me